What up, what up? This is your boy X, back up in that ass with another video, and I'm gonna say screw it, cause this is how we do it. <laughs> Check it out. I was watching the episode of Hoarders, right? And I saw a vision of my future. I saw myself surrounded by vinyl full of mold with rats crawling in and out of the 45 holes and pissing on it and shitting on it. And I was like, I got to do something. I got to declutter my collection. I got to trade four of these for one of those. Yes, that's what I'm going to do. But before I do that, I'm going to show you what I'm going to trade in. And if you think I'm crazy, please let me know. Please hit me up on the comments and say, don't do it. Don't jump. Please. First up to bat. My Bobby Brown collection on 45. And just like it says, it's my prerogative. These are my records, and I can do what I want to do. <laughs> I don't got one or two or three, but I got four Bobby Browns. Every little step I take, rock with you. Roni, and you already seen this one. But you might be wondering, why the hell would you want to get rid of that? I'm going to tell you why. Because I already got the, the LP on vinyl. I got all these songs on one record, and I can just let it play all the way through. I don't got to keep putting this record in and that record out. I ain't got to do none of that. So, Bobby Brown, sorry to say, but you got to go. Next up to bat, the material girl herself. Madonna, my collection of Madonna on 45. I only have two records of her. And look what this record is saying. It's talking to you, to you. It's saying, rescue me. <laughs> Ain't nobody going to rescue you from this, baby girl. You got to go. But check it out, though. Got the cover for this one. It's a nice color vinyl. It's hip. It's trendy. That's what's going on. It's called, this one is called True Blue. Uh, back in the day, I believe the Crips uh, came out with a record called True Blue, and it was uh, executive uh, produced by Easy E, but on the low, though. But uh, that True Blue is nothing like this True Blue. That one, if I had that, I'll keep it. This one, it gotta go. Besides, I got it already on on um, full length album, so I don't need this no more. Sorry, you gotta go, Madonna. Oh, <laughs> let me say here quick, dispense on. To all my Spanish-speaking people out there, because what I'm about to show you, you're going to think I'm crazy. But check it out. I got Vicente Fernandez on 45. I got three of them, actually. And look, this record is talking to me. It's saying, piensalo bien. Think about it. Do you really want to let this go? Could you live without it? The question, I mean, the answer to that question is, see. Sí. You know, I had these for a minute. I, I, I haven't, I only heard them once and I wasn't really feeling it. And I know somebody will, will really appreciate this and, and uh, uh, take care of it. El Pisionero, Vicente Fernandez, singing about me. I was a prisoner before, but uh, that's another story we're going to say for another time. Now, this 45 with Vicente, check it out. He has some gangster ass titles like. Amor de la calle, love for the streets. Just like me, I had love for the streets, but the streets didn't love me back. But anyway, this 45 has four songs. It has two songs on each side. Look, check it out. Check it out. I know I could get something good for this. And I know somebody out there is going to love this record, you know, and play it and, and frame it and do whatever they do with it. Because right here is getting no love, actually. And, uh... To keep it 100 with you, I only got these records because I knew I was going to be able to trade them, and that time has come. Oh, my God. This record right here, I was looking for it, and I found it three times. So why the hell do I need all those copies for? But this is The Animals, House of the Rising Sun, one of the best pieces of music ever put on wax, and it's in perfect condition. I still got the original cover for it. Someone out there is going to love this record. 
this is going to complete somebody's collection right here. And I'm going to make it happen. But they got to make it happen for me. You want this? You got to give me something good in return. Something else. Oh, yeah. Check it out. Like I said, I was in jail before. But I ain't got to live that life no more. You know why? Because I got a 9 to 5. Ah. Dolly Parton, 9 to 5. The, the record is kind of beat up. Yeah, it's kind of scratched up, but I it got the cover for it. So it should be worth something to somebody. And I got another uh, Dolly Parton that you might be familiar with. This one is uh, I Will Always Love You. Uh, if you didn't know, I'm going to tell you, Whitney Houston covered this song. This exact song, and when she did it, she destroyed it. She annihilated it. She hit it out of the park. She owned that record. It was hers. And when somebody told me Dolly Parton uh, recorded it first, I didn't believe it until I heard it. And I was like, damn. But uh, shout out to Dolly Parton for 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 bringing that song out to the world, for introducing it to Whitney Houston, because that what Whitney Houston did to it was amazing. Yes, it was. Oh, another record <clears throat> that I'm. Uh, Debating, I got the Go-Go's. Our lips are sealed. If one thing you learn in jail, if you see something, your lips are sealed, your eyes are closed. Don't get caught looking because program time, homie. <laughs> yeah, but we don't got to live like that no more. And this record right here is uh, near and dear to my heart because every time I play it, 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 it brings me back to my childhood. I remember when my mom and my dad were together and they, and they used to take me to Chuck E. Cheese. That record makes me feel that, that feeling right there. And you might be wondering, why the hell would I want to get rid of that? I'm going to tell you why. Because I got the whole album. And I can play the whole album from front to back. I don't play it loud because I don't want my neighbors to think I'm worried because I listen to the Go-Go's. But I listen to it on a nice volume. You hear that? That's classic. That's enough for that. Another record, another few records. Ooh, man, this artist right here has a movie coming out. It's coming out soon. I've seen the previews. I'm going to go see it, actually. Some people might even call him the king of rock. If you don't know who I'm talking about, I'm talking about Elvis himself. Look at that. Let me be your teddy bear. <laughs> I got another Elvis right here. Frankie and Johnny. And the reason I'm letting these go, because I'm not too familiar with these titles. I believe in the man in the sky. Crying in the chapel. It ain't no blue suede shoes. It ain't no hound dog. And besides, I already got Elvis on record. Full length LPs of Elvis. So so I don't need these. Someone out there is going to love these. Like I, like I said, the movie's coming out. So the value of this went up all the way up. So it's getting traded in. Yeah. All right, then. I'd like to keep my, my, my video short and sweet. So I'm just going to show you uh, some quick ones, too, that I'm going to trade. And we're going to end it. I need your loving by the four tops. I can't help myself by the four tops. Classic. Some Rolling Stones. She's so good. Uh, send it to me. Yeah, send me the check. Give me that money. The police, every breath I take. I got some underground rock right here. I think this is from the 80s or 90s. The underground, like, rock. This is like some punk rock right here. All these records got to go. I don't listen to them. Oh, look, I got to import things from Japan or something. Things oldies in, 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 in Japanese or something. So these records got to go. I'm going to trade them in. Hopefully, I'm, I'm going to get some, uh, some rap 45s or, like, the Smiths or the Cure on 45s. You know, I'm willing to trade like three of these for one of those, okay? So wish me luck. And I'm going to show you what I traded them for too. So stay tuned for that. All right? If you like this video, hit the like, hit the subscribe, leave me a comment, okay? Until the next time, you stay up, stay blessed. Bye.